I think every person who comes to work for NASA dreams of being part of that spacecraft development program that you get to see it launch and you get to see it send humans to the next step in the frontier of space, right? And I think every one of us started with NASA with that dream. Uh, well, I've been out here 12 years. I'm a research laboratory mechanic. They hired me on actually as general labor and said if I did really well, I had a chance to get into the uh, NASA apprentice program. So I did really well and I got into the program. They sent me to school and then on the job training hours to learn the skills that I needed for here. I'm Kale Yeager. I'm part of the Research Laboratory Mechanic Apprenticeship Program. Okay, my name is Steve West. I'm a test facility coordinator here at uh, SEC. I think I'm, I'm my, starting my 37th year. If you want to do the math, I think it's pretty close to that. My name is Erin Reed. Um, I'm a test engineer here at SEC. I'm Nicole Smith. I'm the project manager for Orion Testing here at NASA's Plum Brook Station. For the better part of the last 12 years, I've been working on some form of Orion. Just always been very intrigued by space. I'm inclined mechanically. I go with my hands. Uh, I like building stuff, troubleshooting. So it kind of worked out that I got to partner my skills with my desires and my um, what I enjoy. I would say my main role out here is an operator, especially during test time. I run the compressors for the cryo shroud that changes the temperatures in the vacuum chamber. I really like the people I work with, everybody I work with. We're all working together to, towards a common goal. So there are lots of disagreements that we have, technical disagreements. Um, we may see things with a different perspective, but we all know that it's because we're trying to create the best solution. Data is our product. We don't make any widgets or anything, so that's our product. So I believe the engineering and the techs here are outstanding. I would put them up against anyone in the world. When it's a flight vehicle, you're not just concerned about the data from the test, you're actually concerned about the vehicle itself. When you get in the test conditions and you got the chamber pumped down and the cryo shrouds at the temper it's supposed to be, to me it's exciting. You're part of the crew, you're part of history really, so I think that's very neat. I really feel it's just, it's a really awesome thing to be part of. Um, we are taking that next step, we are doing that next great leap. We face challenges almost daily, which is part of why I love this job. I mean. We keep our crew working very effectively uh, all the time, which is a challenge, and I, I get excited about those things. The idea of the first woman stepping foot on the moon and me getting an opportunity to work on this spacecraft here, it's, it's huge, so um, I'm really excited for this.